New changes to the city of Brainerd began on Monday with the first reading of an updated zoning code. Our reporter Ryan Bowler tells us more. The Brainerd City Council conducted the first reading of the updated zoning code on Monday, which was rewritten and narrowed down by about 75 pages from the original document. I believe that this is a much better improvement over what we have. It is a much better representation of our community as it is today, as well as where I believe the City Council has identified we want to be into the future when we look at our comprehensive plan and our future land use map. Um, so I'm very excited um, and proud of this document. The number one change to this zoning code is a new format that allows zoning districts to focus more on developing the physical character of each area by trimming down the number of zones altogether. Zoning districts, full rewrite. We went ahead and we consolidated, I believe we got rid of about six zoning districts approximately, to make life easier, hopefully, for you, for staff, and your planning commission. The number two thing that we did, reduce the nonconformity in the city. What we mean by that is, how can we reduce the number of variances you see? How do we make sure that people can actually do what they want to do with their property and make it a little bit easier? The revised zoning code is a modernized version of the current zoning code. Ultimately, the Planning Commission wants property owners to be able to achieve their goals for their property in a more simple and hassle-free way. If somebody has a large development area that they would like to bring forward, this is a tool now in your toolbox uh, that you have available. It gives more structure. It talks about street widths, block dimensions, uh, making things more connected, etc. gives a very good framework, but it's a guideline. So folks still have the ability to come in uh, and come up with what they'd like to do in that particular area. After the first reading, Mayor Dave Badeau reminded council members to take their time and thoroughly review the document so that way nothing could be misunderstood before the second reading. Reporting in Brainerd, I'm Ryan Bowler. Lakeland News. And the council will conduct a public hearing on the code before moving on to the second reading during its next meeting on April 4th. Lakeland News is member-supported content. Please consider supporting Lakeland News today.